snow is not going to happen. That is going to be quite nice, but still minor accumulations. But the minor concern actually right now is those slick roads okay. in a few spots from a bit of snow. And that is actually why we have issued Sunday as a first alert yellow day. As we could see some off and on again snow showers into the morning hours and a little slippery uh, commute for some spots as well. As we take a look at our uh, four shot, we do see some light snow on some of the roadways and a little damp on the roads right now, but not too bad. But still, uh, if you're headed out, make sure to use caution, increase your following distance as well. Temperatures right now hovering around the freezing mark 33 in Fort Wayne, 32 in Auburn, 30 in Angola, even 32 in Warsaw, and some light snow across our region as we are seeing a swath continuing to slide its way eastward across uh, the Great Lakes region as well. If you're headed out the door this morning though, bring those boots, gloves, jacket, as well as a hat because we are looking at uh, some chances of some uh, light snow showers, at least for the first half of the day. Into Sunday mid-morning hours, we are seeing mostly cloudy conditions and we'll see that snow continue to slide its way eastward. And then notice by around noontime, not really dealing with too much snow, perhaps maybe a few flurries here or there. Those could linger into Sunday afternoon, mainly into our northern counties. But otherwise, a mostly cloudy skies for the second half of the day. And then eventually, as we head around uh, sunset, we're going to see those clouds break apart. Partly to mostly cloudy skies are expected Sunday evening. And then finally clearing out overnight. But planning your day, temperatures will remain into the mid-30s. Chances for some scattered snow showers. And then mostly cloudy in the afternoon. A bit breezy with winds at the west between around 10 to 15 miles per hour. But in terms of travel impact Sunday, given that yellow light for the uh, morning commute, because we could see a few slick spots here or there, but expecting between around a trace to an inch throughout 21 country. But we do have alert days once again for Sunday as well as into Tuesday. As some impacts are expected, these are uh, the yellow category. And Tuesday we are tracking a little messy system with snow and some chances for rain for our region as well. That is why we have a first alert a yellow day for that day. Some moderate snow in the morning turning to rain in the afternoon and then back to snow into Tuesday evening and then into Wednesday morning as well. Future cast will show uh, some chances of some of those uh, snow showers creeping into the region by late Monday evening. And then eventually notice by around 6 a.m. the commute for Tuesday could be a little tricky for some places. So, so make sure to use caution and uh, if your daily routine may have some slight interruptions. And then to the afternoon, some chances of some of those rain showers. Those will continue throughout the evening hours. And then eventually by around uh, midnight, we're transitioning back into snow on the back end of that system and some lingering snow showers could even uh, hang around into Wednesday evening. And on your first alert extended forecast, 36 degrees Monday, mostly cloudy conditions and expecting to remain mostly dry 41 degrees Tuesday. We also have a uh, first alert weather yellow day for that day, 36 for Wednesday. Chance for some flurries as well, a uh, little active and some chances for some rain snow mix for Thursday, mostly cloudy conditions and some chances for snow showers once again for Friday. So definitely a uh, quite active week. A couple of uh, first alert weather days have been issued as well. And then finally dropping to around average into the lower 30s by the end of the week. Perfect. Thanks so much, Brian. When and the